Elka. My name is Phil, aka JC Servant, with RPAGamer.com, your source for your news, reviews, and home to the biggest gaming community. Awesome, most awesome gaming community. Maybe biggest ain't the right word, but they are the most awesome gaming community on the net. Check out everything we have to offer over at RPGamer.com. And as we left on the last show, uh, our main, main main character, named after, aptly after myself, with his cool beard and everything. Uh, it's now wearing this crown that's totally not cursed at all. It's it's very much not cursed. It's locked in. <laughs> uh, you know, just can't seem to get it out. Probably needs identification. You know, let, let's just see. We, you know, I don't think we actually tried to see if we can cast a identification spell on it. So let's let's try that and see if uh, we can get lucky there and figure out what the heck it is. Oh, see, it wouldn't let me. It wouldn't let me identify it. Let me just try it one more time, but I think it won't let me do it on his crown. It's locked. But it won't even let you try to identify it. That's pretty rude. Okay, so let's take a look at our quest log here. We need to report to the council, I guess, and complete our report. So I reckon we should do that. A lot of cl musty, cloudy effects going on here. Lord Sunblaze, thank you for your hospitality. It's the least we can do for the deputies who proved that there are still Sorax on Celasta. You've proved we cannot relax our vigilance. Did you find anything else that could help us track them? There was a parchment. If you find it, send for the char. You can read that? That last word, it's not Tamarian. It's in the Sorakath tongue. I knew it. It means general. You were wise to run. Also, the fanatics we fought near that old tower. They all have this tattoo on their arm. It seems to support the idea that they were working for the Sorax under duress. It is indeed one of their ways. Now this is the A of Erevet. Can you enlighten us? Between the myth and what we've seen, it's confusing. Of course. We paladins and clerics of Anar are the guardians of these memories. Our ancestors fought the war against the Sorakath. Their god, Sortar, gave them dark powers of treachery, mind reading, and shape changing. They um. infiltrated the human society, corrupted the hearts of men. At some point, everyone was suspected to be a Sorak in disguise. Distrust broke humanity. Sortar had won. He corrupted even Erevad, god of the Inquisitors. The gods themselves decided to run away from Tirmar. They opened the rift for the humans to escape to Celasta. Many of them didn't make it. It was a tragedy. At the sight of the rift, thousands of Sorak tried to cross. Sortar himself tried. The rift was closed in a gigantic blast. Our kings and heroes, Manakalan's masters of magic, were all wiped out. So, how could Sorax have survived, escaped, and then thrived on Celasta? I suppose that's another one of their tricks. But for those who had survived the war, the Exodus, it was paramount to stay vigilant, to keep the memory alive. The memory of what Sorax were, what they could do, so that if one day they were to return, we'd be ready. I'm sorry to say, after a thousand years, only a few of us remain. Now, most people believe Sorax are a mere legend, but you brought us proof the Sorax are not extinct. That's pretty cool. That's actually not a bad story. How do they get people to worship them? They get into people's minds, learn their darkest secrets, 
their fears, their shameful desires. With that, they can blackmail, corrupt, and finally, recruit. It's much easier for them than to duplicate, and very efficient. We fought different ones. Do you know more? The bulk of their army are foot soldiers with poisoned spines. They breed a caste of albino priests able to cast spells. Some of them are deadly assassins, invisible, venomous. Others are giant brutes. The scriptures talk of elite warriors, anti-paladins, the Shikath. Ooh, nice. Can they really impersonate people? It's been proven, though it's a long process. They used to kidnap a target, study it for weeks, sometimes months. One of their chosen ones would transform into a perfect duplicate. Upon death, they would return to their original form. Well, that's all very scary, but thanks, it's going to help us. You're welcome, deputies. If you find anything else connected to the Sor Akath or their allies, bring it to the temple. Talk to Chaplain Delan Lark. You will be well rewarded. Whenever you're ready, the council will meet again. Huh. That's that's actually a pretty interesting and cool story. That's that's actually pretty neat. It's an honor, deputies. Who are you? My name is Maddie Green Isle. I work for the Tower of Knowledge. I'm just a junior aide in the council, but if you ever need to contact my superiors without going through official channels, just see me at the Tower, downtown. Why the sudden interest in us? You proved yourselves in the Badlands. Now, we in the Tower of Knowledge value skilled adventurers. If you find anything of historical value, we'll pay well. And you know, if things go well, we might <laughs> share some of our own secrets. All right, we'll think about it. Might share some of our own secrets. Uh, <clears throat> Can I ask for a minute of your time, deputies? We're in kind of a hurry. I know, I won't delay you long. My name is Hedlund Shorspell. I represent the Arcaneum. And the Arcaneum belongs to the new empire. Do you really want to be seen talking to us? My business is magic, not politics. And no, I have no quarrel with you. You may not see us Imperials as friends, but we take the Council very seriously. We are particularly interested in anything from the old empire that you might find in the Badlands. Anything from the Manakelan era Arcaneum. Even more so. Oh, of course, we'd pay you handsomely for this crown, although I know that's not possible. You're smarter than you look. Also quite indifferent to mockery. <laughs> we have an unrivaled trove of magical and other knowledge. Think it's over. You can find me at the Gravekeep's cask. Really? Not at the embassy? What can I say? I love Martel's beer, even though it tastes like donkey piss. I like the banter. What? How did he... That was our joke the first day we met. Was he spying on us? Maybe he just agrees about the taste. That's cool. Let's spin it around over here. I think there was somebody on the other end. Maybe not. Ugh. Come on, camera. Work with me here. Ugh, these 3D games and their camera. Okay, loading. Your game is important to us. Please stay on the line. <clears throat> it's uh, thinking really hard about this. 
Would you have a moment, deputies? All right, but make it quick. I'll do my best. I am Joyel Foxeye, from the Circle of Denantar. The same magic school where the princess studies? Exactly. Is she a good student? A powerful wizard? That's mm. not for me to say. And you seemed to be in a rush? Fine. I just want you to know that our Grand Master Edvan Denantar has noticed you. He talked a lot, for sure. He's a man of great authority. He'd like you to know that our doors are open to you if you'd care to visit us. You can find me at Sunblaze Court. Interested in Badlands treasures, I suppose? Like everyone else? Well, if you ever come across old spell books or spell scrolls, we'd love to see them. In return, we have the largest collection of spells and potion recipes you could ever hope to see. More than the Arcanaean? They would disagree, but yes. <laughs> now, if you were to prefer feeding the New Empire's wizards with more magical knowledge than the Principality, that would be a troubling choice to many on the Council. Neutrality means we don't treat you any differently than we treat them. Of course, neutrality is the rule. Good day to you, deputies. <laughs> Good day to you too. Clear skies, my friends. Do you know Arwen Merton, the so called first scavenger? Of course. That's it. Mm. With your eyes. It's a painful topic for me. I'd rather not talk about him. Fair enough. Okay. Lovely. Uh, let's head back over here. See if this lady, the mayor, wants to talk to us. I'm busy. Come back later. Guess not. The mayor's always too busy for us. Stay in the light, citizens. Okay. Who am I supposed to see? Try coming over here. I'm supposed to be see, I'm supposed to see somebody at the court. So let me see if I can figure that out. Hmm. Not here. Snow Alliance. Oh, the lake. Maybe the thing that's called Legacy Cancel. Greetings, Sorak Slayers. Hello. I am Halman Summer of the Guild of Antiquarians. I'm instructed to invite you to visit us at the Embassy of the Snow Alliance. You're based at an embassy? I thought the council was neutral. We don't have a house of our own in Kaya Kiflin, unlike the Tower of Knowledge. How about that for neutrality? Anyway, <laughs> we'd be interested in any antiquities you might bring back. We pay very well, even for things you might think are worthless. Like the scavengers? The scavengers? Well, they'd sell an antique emperor's sword for its metal value. But we can offer more than gold. Antique magical items, for instance. You'll never find their like elsewhere. Good to know. Thanks for the invitation. I feel like... Honorable council members, please take your seats. Ah, our crown bearer is up again. Lord Danantar has the floor. Thank you. I have confirmed that our deputy is indeed magically attuned to the crown. It is uh, an uncommonly powerful attunement, unlike anything I've seen. I strongly recommend against forcing separation. Chancellor Gorm's daughter? With the council's permission, I'd like to try a little experiment. Oh, I no. have here. The gem that Captain Merrin recovered recently. I have reason to believe that it might be... <gasps> As I suspected, 
It belongs to the Crown. What have you done? Commander, take Her Royal Highness to safety. No, wait. It's a Thanos gem. Oh. <laughs> Unknown hero. It's <laughs> got lay on hands. Cure wounds, bay, aid, lesser restoration. Let's see, reduce your enemy's attack and saving throws for a turn. That is one minute. <laughs> Let's debuff. Bane struck. Oh, oh, oh. oh, and he can attack at the same turn, because why the hell not? Ooh, that looked like it hurt. Cast a bonus spell. Oh, lovely. Blinded. Let's see, I think a Lesteration clears blindness. Got a lot of big, big lizards, little lizards, all kinds of lizards. Oh, more lizards coming out the gate. Guy's kind of outnumbered. Just gonna put that out there. Kind of outnumbered. Ooh, that took off a slice of hit points. we have here. Your next hit causes additional radiant damage. Oh, increases allies AC by two for how long? Ten minutes. Ooh. I'll take that. He's gonna have a hard time hitting that 24 AC. Wow. We just keep popping out of that gate. Ooh. 
Oh, I think we got through the Deus Ex battle. Let's see. It's loading. Are you going to faint again? I must find the other gems. I just had a vision. What? A vision? In an instant? I was fighting Sorax, but I wasn't myself. Then who were you? A, a paladin. Powerful. From Tiamat. Hmm, that is unsettling. His beard is unsettling. Error, and the other deputies follow that quest. Find the other gems if you can, but keep us informed. In the meantime, we will formulate a response to the Sorax. Let's vote. Delegates, do you agree? Aye. Aye! Your Royal Highness? Oh, pardon me. Yes, I concur. To which proposition, Your Highness? I mean, I. They should go and find the diamonds, the gems. So, resolved. Let it be recorded. Thank you, honored delegates. The council is now in recess. She's totally a Soric. What was that? You had a vision? I... I can't explain. I just feel it. Anyway, we have a new mission. All right, then. So where are we going, Crown Bearer? I think... I think the Crown knows. It's got a red gem in it. Talk to the crown. The crown knows. Well, if it isn't our brave saviors. Well, you're not very helpful. Priest. Angry Bush. Lord Charon. Let's go over here. Travel interrupted. A word, please, deputies. Ugh. What's up? Another one. What's this? A command word to teleport your party to the city's imperial gate. Teleport? We can't do that, I'm pretty sure. Well, word is that in the Badlands, you may come across functioning major gates. If you do, use this command word and you'll be brought back here. Take note of any command word on the gate you find, and you'll be able to return there the same way. That's fantastic. Don't get too excited. So far, no one's found any. Oh, right. Thanks anyway. Stay in the light, senior deputies. You too, Captain. Wait, now we're senior deputies? Did we get a promotion? I feel like we just got a promotion. I feel like we got a promotion. Ah, there you are. Clear skies, my friends. Someone came to see you. Me? Who? An old acquaintance, I gather. Master Dakin. He said he'd wait for you at Sunblaze Court. Oh, thanks for the message. Stay in the light. Everything all right? Like she said, an old acquaintance. Hey, 
Interested in a little side job? <laughs> what kind of side job? The kind that takes particular skills and contacts in the, shall we say, involuntary gift business. <laughs> involuntary <laughs> gift business? <laughs> That's just embarrassing. It is. So what you mean? The underworld, right? And there I was trying to be discreet. Try harder. Suppose I do have the skills and contacts you're looking for. Go to Annie Bagmorta at the Scavengers. Tell her I sent you. She's... Wait, you're talking about the lady who's just, like, literally right over here? Yeah, this Annie, right? She's li literally... She was literally t t 10 feet away. Merton says you've got a problem. Ah. Arwen. What makes you think you can help? Not saying I can yet, but I know people. People who can track down stolen goods. What kind of goods? A sword. Imperial. The guard has three diamonds. Probably magical. Probably? What does it <clears throat> probably do? Never got a chance to find out. You offering a reward? I'll make it worth your while. Are you not the one supposed to bring back stuff? <laughs> Very funny. Cute. Very cute. I like the dialogue. Look who's here. The Sorak Hunters themselves. It's Merton, right? Arwen Merton. Damn right. First scavenger. Where does that come from? Long story, kid. Short version. When we started crossing the marshes to the Badlands, I was one of the first. Now, I'm just the ugliest one left standing. <laughs> what should we know about the Badlands? Any advice? Bring a good cleric with good healing spells. You'll need them. You're a legend. Why do you seem so sour? Sour? It's this ale that's sour. That's all. My chin goes into my chest. The high and mighty council. Paying clueless kids like you to go and get killed in the Badlands. But they're not asking good old Arwen. No. Go figure. It's because I got them figured out. Figured out how? The Legacy Council is full of it. Acting all united and lovey-dovey while they plot to rob each other. Wouldn't surprise me if some of them were even Sorax in disguise. You know they can shapeshift. Uh, okay. <laughs> hey, I was right about them hiding in the Badlands, wasn't I? ka -ching. This is... This is good. This is good. I like it. I really do like it. This is... This is honestly more interesting than some of the other uh, similar RPGs I've played in the not so distant past. I I will say it is it is some good uh, good dialogue there. Hey Scar. You came. I wondered, considering your new rank. Is he missing half his beard? Master? It's nice that you pretend to care. Are you going to hate me forever? I don't hate you. I just... Well, it was your right to leave and pursue a life of adventure, even if it wastes your academic talent. It serves me well, thanks to you. Maybe. Still, I'm without an assistant. Times have been hard. The guild offered me a posting. South. You're not getting your department chair? Evidently not. Unless I can make a major contribution. That's why I wanted to see you. I heard you went to Kerlem. In the marches. That's right. There is an old Termarian tower there. Oh, yes. Very impressive, too. 
If I could just explore it, bring something back, something the guild couldn't ignore, I would have a chance at this chair. The scavengers say it's safe now. I can go. But once there, I'll need, well, some specific expertise. And that's us. It could salvage my career. Of course. I owe you that much, Master. Thanks. Find me at Kerlem then. I'll be ready. I swear half his beard's we'll missing. Stay in the light, Master. That's again, this is all like little cool even the side quests are little cool setups. I, I like it. It's nothing like Game of Thrones deep. It's not super different than anything from before, but it's decently done. Deputies, do you have anything for the circle? Take a look. Plus six and plus eight for the Imperial Gate plaque and the myth. Myths of Solasta. 50 gold. Interesting. Stay in the light, deputies. Let's see what the other... What the other persons would offer. Fast travel is your friend. Deputies, how are you today? Do you have some lovely loot from the Badlands? It's all about the loot. Just missed your smiling face, Miss Green Isle. Such nice manners. All too rare, the. Wait, no, that is, I wanted to see if she would give me anything for this. Deputy, do you have... Indeed. Archaeological notes. Tim, Marion, Inquisition journal. So it looks like they'll take some of the different stuff. Clear skies to you. We've got Alliance over on her. Okay, who else can we trade with? Oh, what about this guy here? Zip. We're all about just trading with all kinds of different people because we can. We're all about playing both sides of the fence. We're neutral. We're, we're actually profiteers. Clear skies, adventurers. Anything new for... Check this out. I always like how they say, like, check this out. They're, like, pushing their hand forward. Stay in the light. Well, that's good. At least we got rid of some of that stuff that was clogging up our inventory. Now, I haven't got really into the crafting system. Um, oh, what happened to the... Oh my gosh, I think we just hit a glitch. Ooh, ah, hmm. May we come out and go back in? Or is it just... Uh, this is really weird. There we go. That was weird. Hello, adventurers. What can I offer you? We'd like to stay for the night. 